Hello everyone, my name is Marwa and I'm 12. So today I would like to talk about my favorite language. First, I love English. English is, is such a very beautiful language because it contains many vocabulary and good expressions. By learning English, it gives you the possibility to travel to other countries and to visit new cities to know more about their traditions. You can meet people from, from different nationalities to, to share your ideas with in English if you don't know their language. As my opinion, I found that English is more fun to learn because every Saturday we go to Cambridge classes and learn a lot, but not in a traditional way because our teacher helps us by playing games to improve our accent. When I, when I grow up, I wish I can travel to the UK or to the USA because I want to know more about their culture and I want to try the delicious dishes. Hi everyone, I'm Mohammed, I'm 12, and today I share with you some information about my favorite sport, which is football. First of all, football is one of the really famous sports around the world. It's a club team and also international world that they, that they play competition and leagues like La Liga or UEFA Champions League or the Asian Cup. The two teams need to have the 11 start, it does, that is mean to have 11 prayer for each team. But you can't play this game without rule. You can start first and second half without, uh, without the first pass. Second, if you touch the ball with your hand, it will, be, it will uh, accept a foul for the other team and maybe you will get a red or a yellow card. Third, if you do a, a bad tackle and, and uh, it accepts a foul, you can get a red or or a yellow card. Fourth, if the ball, if the ball uh, get, get out for, from the line, it will accept a uh, throw-in or a corner. Fifth, if you want to score, if you want to score a goal, the ball needs to depend the line of the of the goal of the other team. So I choose to talk about football because it's my favorite sport and it's exciting. And also, I really enjoy to watch it on TV. Hello, my name is Nizam Aki. I'm, uh, I'm 12 and today I'm going to be talking about the projects of technology. Uh, what is technology first? Technology is what our generation is known for. It has, uh, it, it helps us a lot in our schools and etc. At first technology was created for the military uh, so they can keep, uh, so they can stay in contact. And uh, over the years to come it has changed a lot. Uh, to the point where we can even talk uh, with our friends. Uh, it has many positive and negative things. For the positive things, it can help. It can help us uh, do projects and etc. And for the negative things, uh, it makes us um, uh, talk to strangers that we don't know or uh, meet predators in real life. Uh, and we have like uh, websites like Google. Uh, there, there are webs, but it has many negative. Uh, things like going to the dark web where they can sell illegal stuff. So that's why we need to use uh, our phones with precaution. Hi everybody, I'm Aya Ahmadi. I'm studying in the Salam school in the first section of preparatory school. Today I want to share with you my topic about basketball. Basketball is a team sport in which two teams, each usually consisting of five players, compete against on a rectangular court, competing to achieve the main goal which is basketball. The opposing team must be prevented from shooting. A fouled goal is cost two points unless it is made from behind the three points line when he is qualified to to three points. After committing a foul, play stop at the, sp at the specified time and the player who commits a foul or he is qualified to commit a foul on one, two or three free throws is awarded one point. In the end of the match, the team who has the most of points is the winner. But if regulation play ends uh, with the score tied, an additional period is imposed called extra time. My favorite sport is basketball. I play basketball every Saturday morning with my friends. We play it on the court of the club of my school. Uh, I am good at dribbling and shooting the ball. Uh, there are some times that I practice with my own basketball at home and uh, I also enjoy watching matches, uh, videos uh, uh, with, of basketball on TV. Uh, my favorite team of basketball is Lakers. Hello everyone, my name is Yasser Abdullah. I'm 12 years old. Uh, today I will uh, talk about Morocco. Morocco is a country situated at the north of Africa. It, uh, its population is 38 million. It has a red flag with a green star that symbolizes Muslims in Morocco. 
It has Aska Pichol Rabat. But it has also many other touristic cities like uh, uh, Agadir, Tangier and Marrakesh. Many people come to Morocco to taste the delicious uh, dishes and traditional food. Um, but uh, they come uh, also to uh, admire and enjoy the beautiful nature, the lakes, river, etc. So be proud to be Morocco. Hi everyone, my name is Yasmin, I'm 12 years old. Today I will talk about my subject, which is Palestine. Palestine is an ancient Arab country located between the Mediterranean Sea and the Jordan River, where it was occupied by Jews, which deprived it of its large lands, uh, of its large parts of its land. The Palestinian lands were divided by the occupation forces to three sections to become three sections: uh, a common part, a part of a Palestinian people, and uh, a part of an occupation. As for its geographical uh, location, it's uh, located in the continent of Asia, uh, we are, and we are wondering if this uh, country will be ever free. All researchers emphasized to the liberation of Palestine, like researchers Ahmed Yassin said, uh, Israel has not colonized any uh, country more than 80 years old, and uh, Palestine will be liberated in uh, 2027. And uh, to support this country, as for us, we can uh, support pa the Palestinian people by uh, boycotting Zionist products. And thank you for watching this video.